Hello everyone, thank you for joining me. Time to grab out your journal, pencils, rulers and texters. Before we begin, get into a comfortable position. Take a deep breath. As you breathe in, imagine all the creativity flowing into you. And as you breathe out, imagine all of your worries rushing out of you. Now, you're in the right mindset to begin. September, already. It feels like I only just finished my August spread video. So, as we're going into spring, I think it is only fair to make this spread spring and the floral theme. The good thing about this one is that you only need three to five tools to complete it. So grab a pen, ruler, and pink highlighter, and let's get started. For the cover, we're drawing a line diagonally over both pages, and a box on the right side, but leave a gap on the bottom right. This will be the cover page. Next, I'm writing September in the top center in all caps. Extend the R to write 2022 on either side. Then I'm going to add stalks for the flowers later and at the bottom. Now, with a highlighter, add the flowers by scribbling around in a circle-like shape. And in the middle, draw three small petals with a pen. Now for extra flair, sprinkle clusters of dots around them. Back up to the top and we'll add flowers there too. Don't forget to colour in the heart. Outline the title with a highlighter and we'll add the calendar. Now, for the mostly left hand side, just draw a bunch of flowers the same. They don't have to be neat, literally just scribble in a circle.
over to the next page. This will be our outline, as usual, for writing this month's goals. So get your ruler and trace boxes like so. I'm going to name this page Monthly Outline. Now add titles to each of your boxes. I have done the first two as goals and events and the other two are for you to add whatever you need. I'm also going to add flowers between each set of boxes, very similar to the cover. Now in the side box I'm adding a floral picture for decoration. I apologise you can't really see what I'm doing but I'm basically just freehanding and, free and sketching out some basic flowers and, and leaves. It's not meant to be perfect, the messier the better.
then add colour. I also brought my pink brush pens along, but you can use whatever you like or do it all with the highlighter. And done. Now, the next page, of course, is a gratitude journal. So start by drawing an outline around the page. And add the title and points, which I did in hearts to match this month's theme. Lastly is something new I want to add, which is an end of month reflection. This is to come back to at the end of September when you're doing your next spread and to just reflect on the month. Write down all the fun things you did or accomplished. For this, draw two boxes outlining the page. I have done a five dot space between the outer and inner line. Then add the flowers and title for final touches. Okay, done. So, final flip through. The cover page with beautiful flowers, asymmetrically, and a calendar. Then monthly outlined and a gratitude journal. And lastly, a page for an end of month reflection. And that's it, September bullet journal complete. I hope you enjoyed drawing with me. If you completed it, well done. If you like this content and want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching and I hope you have an absolutely amazing week. Bye.